Hello all and welcome to episode 13 of this EU4 Austria Holy Roman Empire attempt um, where we obviously centralise the whole state, everyone being just me. Um, right, I can't really remember where we're at but from having a look at this war I think I, from the vaguest of memories I was uh, trying to force convert these guys because I'm trying to stop any religious issues coming up. Obviously they're going to happen. If they happen down here, I'm not too fussed. That's not within my realm. Well, it will be. But it's it's not for me to worry about just yet. Now, I mean, I'm just wondering whether I can take any clay with this. Well, I do have a free... I'll keep them free for now. I'm not under force limit. What's the mission I've got done? Austrian Netherlands. Oh, yeah, I was going to leave that. Imperial Ascendancy. Diplo Power. Annexation cost. I was going to save that... Oh, I am. I'm doing it anyway. 860 days, and it's 20% through. That saves me 10%. Well, I want to scale it up with one of these, don't I? I want to take that and scale up that mission, and then that should save me quite a, a bit of Diplo power for... Um... Is it Bohemia? Yeah. Bohemia. All right, let's carry on with this war, then. Oh, speed five. Let's slow that down a bit. Because I don't quite know where I'm at. I was just thinking, I'd quite like to take Venice. How's my aggressive expansion looking? Zero. A little high over here. Nothing too bad. The Italians have nothing against me, so... Um, let's, let's begin looking at Venice. For a couple of reasons. They are the wrong faith. And they've got some pretty nice land, which is really the main reason I'm looking at it. Got a bit of cash here. What am I looking to do with it? Do I have any loans? I bet I do. I usually do. Oh, no, I don't. Money's looking good, though. Um, what idea groups am I working on? None. Okay, good. And that's not fired yet. Okay, I'm looking pretty good overall. Um, yeah, sure. Go to war. Could state people up, but I'm not going to just yet. But yeah, from looking at the aggressive expansion, I've not been aggressively expanding enough. <laughs> um, you're... Ah, uh, it's the rebels. I'll probably just call my jet skiddies the rebels. Ooh, yeah, nice. Ten years of reduced aggressive expansion. I like that. So how long is left of this? Ah, okay, so that is on a countdown. Now, do I take the Golden Era? How long is left of it? I don't know. Oh, there. 27 months. Okay. So, before that runs out, I'll fire my Golden Age just to get it done. So, I've got some men here. I mean, you don't need to be here. Is there anybody else we're at war at over here? No, it looks like we've got to be fully occupied. So, you guys... Yeah, I'll help them out with their peasants and then come home. we go. Now come home. You can go back to Vienna. Orthodox zealots. I bet these are over here, right? Yeah, it might be worth you just going over here just to keep these people under control. Nuremberg, you're a public. I can bring one of you off. I'm going to do it anyway. They're going to have unrest that they won't be able to deal with now. It looks like... Yeah. Ideas. What are we looking at next? 
I can't quite remember where we're at. Okay, so we've got diplomatic ideas, we've got defensive ideas. Because the Age of Reformation is going to fire very shortly, I think we have to go religious ideas. Just so we can keep the Reformation under control. I don't want it affecting what we do. Um, Strasbourg. I'm happy to drop you out, that's fine. It's mainly Munich I have an issue with. I don't need to be Defender of the Faith, although it does mean I've got a bit more cash now. Okay, here we go. So, annexation cost. Drop that, and then we're going to fire this one off for the annexation cost again. And here, that's gone from 20 to 28% progress. So, that's quite a jump, um, and we should progress a fair bit faster now, hopefully. Are we looking for disputed succession? Anybody we can take advantage of? Maybe Croatia. Who are they allied to? Just the Pope. How are we diplomatic relation wise? We're at 7 of 7. Can't really afford to give anyone up. How are we for. Hmm, loyalty is pretty good. Now I need more diplo power. You give me military, you give me diplo. I could give up 10 land. For the monthly diplo. I'm going to do that. Only because we're desperate for it to get Bohemia under us as quickly as we can. Now, truce wise, can we go to war with Poland again soon? 1519, by the looks of it. Oh, we have no truce with Poland. It was Danzig. Really? Interested. And how are our votes going? Ah, oh, we have no issues there. This will go up a little bit each month. Okay, so I think we can finish this war off and begin to focus on our next one, which is going to be Venice. On a forced religion. No point in pillaging. May as well do that. And we'll finish the war there. Oh, let me just check Trent's religion, because they are pretty close to an area where they may convert. No. I'm going to white piece them out if I can. Yeah, I'll wait till I can do that. I want a shorter truce with Trent, because they're in a region where they may very well convert, and I, I don't want that. So... If they do, we're going to go and blast them and say, Oi! Pack it in! And that'll be the aim. There we go. Right. So, Sue, I'm not going to take anything from them. Because I want that short truce. But you... Force religion. Uh, might as well take any cash. Job done. You just put down the zealots over here if you could. I assume you are... Well, you're not. Okay. okay. Let's get rid of all them. You guys just come home to here. Now, we were... Oh, I just forgot to cancel the spy network. How are we looking religion-wise in the Empire? I've clicked the wrong button. Ooh. Okay, I need to go to war with these guys, because they're converting people I don't want them to convert. Doesn't look like I can go to war with them. So we'll build a spy network on them as quickly as we can. Losing three a month on that, but we are making progress, which is good. Is there any other... We could just go to war with Croatia. Are they part of the Empire? They are now. Oh yeah, I forced them to, didn't I? Yes, I remember now. I was adding people to the Empire in the hope of... Um, centralising them later. But Poland. Yeah. Screw it. Right. We're going to have aggressive expansion. 
Let's make it with Poland. I want land. I want it now. Now. Our focus is still on Diplo. Okay, so that's good. I'm earning a chunk of cash now. It might be worth to spend a bit. Right, trade centers. Oh, yeah, I'm sure Vienna was one. Yeah, Vienna's a two. Prague is a two. Oh, crack out. Yeah, you can go at one. Oh. Uh, I need to state you, do I? You're not Central Poland, you're Malovska. I'm missing one. So I think it's worth it just to... I'm not behind on tech or anything. Uh, okay, no, actually. I won't stay for now. Is there any over here that are mine? Zurich feels like it sh probably should be. Yeah. Again, not in a state. Ugh. All right, just buildings for now. Tax. Hmm. Grasslands, farmlands. Yeah, nothing good there. But over here. Farmlands, 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 grasslands. No good places. Woods are okay. Mountains would be pretty nice. Yeah, okay. Uh, hmm. You can have that. We'll save up some cash for a bit. But yeah, we're going to smash Poland for a bit. We've got plenty of claims over there. Do you want to take a little diversion and then come back up? Just happen out with the rebels. Do I have any... Um... No, I don't have any spare generals, but... No, why not? There you go. Should keep hungry, sweet. Now, you guys. It seems you don't like me. But you may like me enough if I keep improving relations with you. Okay. I'm actually going to go for Venice on the next one. You're not protecting trade. What are you doing? Actually, no, just stay here a sec. Let's move the gaddies. You protect trade. Yeah, Constantinople. I love that name for a city. It's such a cool name. Shame they decided not to keep it. Yeah, that's the way to go. I'm going to get on Venice. I need something to fight against them. Do I have a truce with Venice? No. I already have three claims. Do I? Oh. Oh, I'm just wasting my time there, aren't I? Well, we're going for Poland first, and then we'll go Venice. Who are you allied to? Volgast. Um... I don't think anybody's warned me or anything, so I should be able to just pound on you. Um, who do we want in? I'm not going to do the Imperial Liberation. I'm not too fussed by that. This is Danzig. Oh, wait. What would that be? Would that be the release of two tons? I might release the Teutons. 
So Malbork, where is Malbork? Oh, it's here. Yeah, okay, so they went for them. I'm going to go for my, my own stuff. Um, 441, 332, maybe Lubin. Lubin. 21. There we go. So on my own, should have enough to smash them, but I'm going to bring everyone in. This is why you have the favours, right? Um, yeah, we'll cancel you. You're doing lunch shots, right? Yeah. Thank you. Okay, we are now at war. I have a tech to take. I'll take it. We'll add religious ideas as soon as we've got the admin to do so. There looks to be a decision I can take. Missionary strength, I would certainly like. And I'd also like the tolerance of heathens. I'm not going to worry about the stab cost modifier. Um, we just need to be able to convert people. Yeah, okay, that's good. Um, so, yeah, I think maybe we go down this way. You, who's got the most cannons? You. You go for Varshava. You go for Rava, so you got backup. You're going to Samyersh. Yeah, recall you and just go to allies for a bit. I would quite like to control the Popehood. The Pope, the people say the Popehood. I'm the Pope in the hood, yo. I've been watching Trailer Park Boys for the first time and it's crazy how bad good it is. Right, so Hungary are doing their bit. Bohemia should be jumping in soon. Burgundy are coming over. Really, it should be... It should be pish, this war. We have the economy to support much larger numbers. I'm going to free the Teutons and see if they uh, join. Probably else has taken one. Me too. <laughs> uh, I'm a one. The reduced power cost to get through those religious ideas actually is probably the good time to do it. Oh, I've got the war goal. You get to a Vishnu. What's this? Military access from Ingerstadt? Of course. Um, mission fulfilled. What's this one? Still the Austrian Netherlands. Nothing new. Okay. I know I wasted manpower on the the, the siege of siege of uh, Vashava there, but I've got it to burn, so I'm not gonna worry about it too much. Um, yeah, come here. That's it, you take pause now, and I'm going to give that to Bohemia. I think. Maybe. Oh. Is there... How is... Okay, I don't need to worry about... Um, liberty Desire. So... As I'm going to do that, I'm going to add on the nobility integration because that knocks another 5% off. It gives them liberty desire, but it disables any uh, reputation penalties. So here, if we look, I've got nine diplomatic reputation. That's off the charts, but it'll take a hit of three for everybody we annex, particularly Bohemia, as they're an elector as well. I'm going to get a bit of a hit. But to disable that penalty, it's significant. It means people will still vote for us. So I'm going to hop that in. I don't mind. Yeah, that's fine. Because now they're going to have some liberty desire, but it's not going to be huge. 
And knock me up a little notch again. Um, I will take the prestige. Yeah. And a half off level three, which I think I can afford. Was it that one? Yeah. Take you, Fort Defense. We'll still make a bit of money. Can you get here? No. Okay, I'm happy for you to wait. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll take the claim. <laughs> Something else that's easier to... ...to core up. Looks like my guys have a... Ooh, army tradition or professionalism. I'll take the tradition. So, it's just Riga, Danzig, Lithuania. Are Lithuania still a junior partner? They are. Oh, military tech. Boom. Yeah, let's um, go Culverin. Because they're long barrels, and I like things with long barrels. Giggity. Oh. Enemies are... Oh, they're down here, the rascals. We're at Castile, by the way. I did call Castilian, right? They decided they didn't want to come. Alright, well, you come down here. The zealots rose on them. <laughs> well, thanks, guys. Do me a favour. Ooh, okay, they're stacking up quite a lot. You come along, too. Wait here. I want them to go to that Kyriob, and we'll just smash them. Seed burn to Australia. Who's this? A subject of ours currently holds... Um, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so where is... Ah, here. Okay, we don't need to. We have a core on it? We don't have a core, we just have a claim. I will just leave it because I'll inherit them anyway. Oh, you done. Nice. Gotcha. You come here, we're going to try and kill any small stacks that we find. We should have the advantage, having just taken um, next tech. Yeah, maybe to there. There we go. See if we can catch him on the way. Right, so we are now in the next era. How many men do we have? Oh yeah, we've got plenty. Um, I don't think that's a fight we should take. Can we take that one? Oh, where are they going? Akana. Just wait. Got ya. So you're fine there. Where are Castile? They're doing this to me. I'm going to do this to them in their next war. And they're going to regret it. Where are you, Castile? What are you doing? Did I call you in? I thought I called you in. I did. You're not at war with anyone else. So what are you doing? Hmm. They'll be Spain soon, won't they? What happened? We'll finish them off. 
Oh, admin tech. Nice. That's perfect for us, actually. Let's um, just do that. Make sure we're nice and sound. Solid front lines. And you come up as well. Looks like we've got a fight here. But we may as well protect ourselves on it. Where are our allies? Are they not actually here? Did they leg it? I mean, this is my small stack, isn't it? Well, losing one fight occasionally isn't every isn't too bad. I'm glad my vassals are all right. Oh, who's this? Yeah, I don't need to worry about that. You, I'm going to fabricate a claim just so I can be a dick to you in a bit. I might do it in a minute, actually. And yet yeah, we can go back to neighboring countries. We're going to take a big chunk out of Poland, I think. As big as we can. That's my aim. So you're going to Lvov. Lvov? Lvov! I have no idea what they're really called. But I like the idea of being calling. Wow! Grasslands. Alright. Yeah, you... Yeah, pound them. That wipe, that was a wipe. Nice. Um, yeah, might as well just blast. Get things moving a bit faster. You run away to a fort. You brave souls. Oh, I'm missing an advisor. Shouldn't be doing that. Um, anybody half price? Yeah, trade efficiency guy. Nice. I'll take you and your orthodox... Oh, God, too many orthodox advisors. I might get some trouble with the Pope for this. Speaking of Popey, how much do you like me at the moment? Mm, quite a lot. <laughs> and threatening, why not? Let's just move you off. And we'll split you to go here. Then we'll move them all onto the Poldol thing pretty soon. They're going to come down for a fight, I think. So they're jumping in with 12. They've got other guys coming. You're running the wrong way. How many do we have? We have 20k here. Trade province. Bohemia. Why are you guys not jumping on? <sighs> ah, well, Castile are finally arriving by the looks of it. Oh, you may as well go to Kelm. Well, looks like we got the win on that fight. <laughs> well, my men need to get away. You can appear with them. These seven stack can get everything finished off. You guys can tidy it down here. Don't worry about Lithuania. It looks like they may be losing their loyalty. They will do when I take a chunk of Poland. Anyway, so it looks like the war with Poland is almost over. Is this Polish or Danish? This is Poland. It's usually the Danes that get that, but cool. Good to know. Um, yeah, so we're going to leave the episode there. We'll carry on with our war with Poland, and then we'll keep on with our religious celebrity in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Toodles!